Welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV. A little event right now. Uh, namely, it's an Easter event. Rebel vs. Rabbit. The X Umbro Calamity. Come on, come on, for Hatchling Tide is upon us once more. My name is Jilly Aliepo, and it's my pleasure to make your acquaintance. No doubt you're wondering why I'm dressed the way I am, but do not worry, all will be clear in due time. Now don't tell me, you're an adventurer, yes? Well, you certainly have the inquisitive nature of one, at any rate. May I ask your name? Serenia. Well then, Serenia. I should probably mention that Hatchling Tide all began with a vision I had before the seventh Umbral Calamity, in which were twelve Archons delivered unto me a message. From atop their giant decorated eggs they called to me. Arise, young dreamer, and make ready the vessels of our return. When I awoke, I quickly set about filling the realm with all manner of painted over it. And thus did this joyous yearly celebration come to be. And before you ask, yes, this custom is the result of yet another vision. I but recently dreamt that a veritable horde of hippity hoppity rabbits descended on the realm for hatchling tide, delighting children found white with their button cute noses and cotton, cotton white tails. Why rabbits, you may ask, and the question is a valid one. After all, rabbits do not lay eggs, nor are they traditionally associated with the Archons in any particular way. Unfortunately, I have no answers to that question, and yet so vividly do I remember the smiles and the faces of each and every youngling in my dream that I swore I would bring this vision of Hatchling Tide to life. Might you be so kind as to lend me a hand? Uh, uh, puns. Sounds excellent to me. Oh, thank you, my friend. With your aid, I have no doubt that this year's incarnation of Hatchling Tide will be the most exciting and extravagant yet. And so, without further ado, I would encourage you to seek out my associate, Nonota, near the Carline Canopy. She will be most happy to enlighten you as how to might, how you might assist us in making year, this year's festivities something to remember. Interesting hat to the Red Mage outfit here. Mm. Is she? Mm. Bright eyed rabbit. Hello, little one. The happiest of hatching tides to you, my dear. And to you. And you have found her. I may have more fur and whiskers than usual, but I can assure you that it is me inside the most charming costume. Greetings, my adventuring friends. I trust you are enjoying the festivities. Julie and I have spared no effort or expense to make this year's hatchling tide the best the all has seen. Now, pray tell, what might I do for you? Come to help with the festivities, you say. Your presence is most welcome and then some. Julie and I have our hands, or shall I say, paws, full here, and we would be most indebted to you for your assistance. Um, this costume in rain is probably pretty, pretty uncomfortable. This looks like a material that will really soak that rain off. And then, you're dripping wet. Allow me to explain. In the hopes of turning this year's hatchling tide into a true event for the ages, we scoured the realm and procured a host of chickens that would lay for us the most remarkable eggs. 
Sadly, the other day I got distracted for a moment and neglected to properly shut the door to the storehouse where we were keeping them. Before I knew it, the birds had all flown to the flown the proverbial, or literal in this case, coop. Needless to say, without our hands there can be no eggs, and without our eggs there can be no hatchling tide. Surely you see our plight, and so I beg of you, my friend. Please go out there and catch our precious birds before they are swallowed up by the beasties at Prowl Woods. I have but one more small request for you, and that is that you don one of those lovely rabbit suits and wear it while you go about the deed. Why? Why, you ask? Let it suffice to say that Gilly's vision has never led us astray before, and uh, I do not expect this to change. You may be skeptical now, but believe me, once you put it on, you'll n not readily want to part with it, and that's why I'm happy to say that we will be happy to give to one to you in commemoration of your effort should you see the task through to completion. Sent to a shroud of fate. There's already a ton of bunnies. Chickens before. Oh, we catch chicken. Give it to me. This is how it works. Um, come, slow down, chicken. I get you. Ten bejeweled eggs. Okay. And back to town. Uh, remove the costume. Okay. No, no. No, not now. There she is. We are finished with our quest. Welcome back, friend. I'm pleased to inform you that we've counted your chickens and you. Uh, Counted our chicken have all safely returned to the coop. Truly, you have done us no all of the yours here. A great service this day. Without further ado, I must report back to Gilly and share these good tidings. If you have no other pressing matters, pray join me. I'm quite certain our lead seller one will want to offer her thanks in person. I know largest guy. So Gilly? No, not us, Serenia. I hear that, in no small part thanks to you, our most co confounding chicken conundrum has been resolved. Excellent work, if I do say so myself. <laughs> you are truly a pirate gone among adventurer, an exemplar of a. Uh, forgive me. <laughs> At any rate, thanks to you, we can mm, at long last begin the festivities in earnest. Let the curtain rise to a hatchling tide on a hatchling tide to remember. As promised, you will now be rewarded with a stylish rabbit costume of your very own. 
we'd be most ex ex oh god we'd be most ex expressive uh, uh that doesn't work quite work does it uh no it doesn't if you could don it for the duration of the festivities to add an extra touch of charm and delight to the celebration and with that i had best get back to my post before the chickens run off again Don't tell no not I said with Serenia, but I'm counting on you as much as anyone to make this year's hatchling title a sounding success. Promise that you won't go far, will you? So yeah, we get a rabbit costume. Cannot equip gear to hands, legs or feet. Not that it matters when you um glamour it. Yes, you can still equip other equipment of course, but it just doesn't show. The conclusion of first quest of this year's Hatchling Tide. For details on when the second quest will be available, check the Lodestone. So there will be a second quest later in the event. And just to have shown it off. You can of course color that stuff. Um, all kinds of fun colors if you want so yeah okay that's the first part of hatching tight see you when the second part is released yeah the second part of a hatching tight event is there so let's look a procession extraordinaire Be hatchling tied to you, my friend. Thanks to no small, no small to your efforts, every last one of our egg-laying assets has been returned to us, with, and the festivities are in full swing. As we speak, Nonota is preparing for the highlight of this year's event, a grand procession in which a host of individuals dressed as rabbits will parade through the streets, sending out exquisitely decorated eggs to the children of the city. Doesn't that sound like fun? If you'd care to join us, and we be most appreciated if you did please seek out nonota my co my colleague would be more than happy to fill you in on the details grand possession huh? hmm. happy hatching tied to you friend how do you fare on this most extravagantly exciting day of days Enough already. Oh dear, I seem to have gotten carried away here. Do I? Um, ec excuse me. Anyhow, might I be correct in assuming that you're looking to take part in the grand procession? If so, then you have come to the right place. As Chili no doubt explained to you, we have planned for a great parade of celebrants to walk the streets of a town, handing out eggs to every child in sight. These are eggs for eating, of course, but uh, ex exquisitely decorated ones hollowed out and ho housing a host of lovely gifts inside. These remarkable specimens have been prepared especially for the occasion by the impressive lineup of some of the realm's greatest luminaries. No doubt, they are putting the finishing touches on their masterworks even as we speak. I was just about to go to our designated that meeting point to receive them myself. But I fear that there are last-minute par parade preparations that I must attend to here. Might you be so kind as to go in my stead? Keep a, uh, uh, ah, forgive me. I mean to say, you're the one come for a hatching tide. So X, are you not? I'm happy to inform you that they have been crafted precisely according to Geely and her dreamer's request. Every one, last one housing a delightful tweet that is sure to please a lucky child. What manner of tweet, you ask? Why, none other than the home-baked cookies prepared by myself and my siblings from only the freshest ingredients harvested from the 12th foot and blessed 
by the Gra Guardians of the Forest. I must admit I'm surprised to see that you will be one to deliver them, but there's none who I would sooner trust with her most important delivery. Go with the elemental's blessing that you might bring joy to the young ones of our fair city on this most wonderful of occasions. By the Scarlet Senna, right? Because the staff, I mean. So the seeds, this, this uh, cookies baked by the seeds, yes, yeah? Oh, if it isn't Serenia, my dear son's boon companion. Ah! I observe that your expression is a curious one. Clearly, you are at a complete loss as to the identity of a virile, gentle rabbit who stands before you. Ah, but it's a fine hatching tide this year, is it not? The colorful decorations about the town, the fes festive mood in the air. Why, it is enough to make a man a, a rabbit, such as I, lift up his leg, put up his paws, and dance. <laughs> but I must not forget why I'm here to begin with. Behold, a veritable chicken coop worth of ornamental eggs, each containing a gold hairpin fashioned with a delightful egg motif. What child would not rejoice to receive such a stylish and special gift, I ask? None but I know. <laughs> Speaking of children, I wonder, whatever is my dear son up to these days? Uh, it has been so very long since he wrote. Uh, Godbert Mandeville. If such a person approached you, wouldn't you freak out? The half-naked guy with a with a bunny hat. Ah, it's you. Come to collect the eggs on behalf of Jillian and her dreamers. Yes. Rest assured, I've prepared a full batch for you, each containing an assortment of sugar cookies prepared fresh at the Caroline Canopy. Take them with my blessings, Arania. And should you tire of the festivities, know that you're always welcome at the canopy for a piping hot pot of for a piping hot pot of tea. The orc. <laughs> what was her name? Mama Mion, right? That was her. I guess. Okay, and where now? To Nonota, okay. There you are, my friend. I trust you had no trouble procuring the eggs. Ah, there we are. And be I believe I speak for Jilly and all the Dumas when I say I cannot thank you enough. With that, at long last, the grand procession can begin. If you are still willing to take part, pray join me and your fellow participant in the starting line in Old Quidania. can go along, but I won't we wear a rabbit costume, sorry. Well there, this fate should be it, right?
Okay, are you ready, my friends? For payout is about to begin. We make for the Lancer skill. Come, come, come on, come on. Don't forget the children share the gift of hatching title for and all. Best hatching tight ever. Gerald? Shard must go empty handed. Oh, work here, son. More children. Look, it's a talking rabbit. Carrying the axe. <laughs> Isn't that adorable? Have a present, children, wait, spooky, givey, spooky, takey. Get a neck. Oh, I can't give you a neck. Children. Here, children, more surprise eggs. Marks the end of procession. Be proud, my friends, we have met many a chance. Happy this day. Should you be willing to join again, we welcome your participation. Till next time, a happy hatching tied to one and all.
Back to no Nota. <sighs> Welcome back, Serenia. Thanks to you, I'm proud to announce the possession was a resounding success. Why, I've never seen so many happy children before. <laughs> Some seemed quite intimidated at first to see a veritable army of oversized rabbits. But they quickly changed their tune after receiving the gift of extravagant eggs containing all manner of tasteful and toothsome treats. No doubt Gili is overjoyed with how things turned out. Will you come with me to deliver the good tidings to our dreamer in chief, yes? Serenia, Nonota, once again hatching tight has been a success beyond even my wildest dream, and I have a two of you to thank for it. Thank you, Jilly, but we all know that none would, of this would have been possible were it not for your prophetic visions and the remarkable passion with which you pursued making them a reality. You're far too kind, my friend. It is because of you that the parade was found away the highlight of this year's festivities. Why I was originally intending to stand aside and direct the procession, but everyone looked to be enjoying themselves so much, I simply had to take part myself. I for one will not, be be will not begrudge you, and don't say that too loud, some might be less than happy to hear that you abandoned your post. At any rate, it is more than clear from the beaming smiles on the faces of all the children in attendance that this, this year's hatching tide has been nothing less than a resounding success. Our patrons played a great part of it in this as well. Believe it or not, Serenia, every last one of them volunteered their services only after hearing that you would be a part of our festivities. Something that I, might, that I uh, <laughs> might have told them before you actually volunteered, but let's not overburden ourselves with the details, shall we? At any rate, there is no doubt that, because of you, our fledgling festival is more beloved by the people of Eorzea than ever before. When I think of a time when a child between here today tell their children of her fond memories of celebrating Hatchin Tide, it fills my heart with no end of pride and joy. <laughs> Dreaming of a future is all well and good, Jilly, but might I remind you that the festivities must still go on in the present? I dare say we both have a job to do. Oh, but you are right, Nonota. I must be getting back to my post and prepare for the next procession. If you have no other pressing matters to attend to, we would be we'd most we would most appreciate if you could join us once more before the celebration is through. If not for us, then for the children. Maybe. New wares are now available from the Dreamers in exchange for Bejeweled Eggs. You have unlocked the Egg Hunter Rigi minigame. Open the toy chest in your room to... Zapper Rabbit Suit. That is, as far as I can see, the only new thing here. And nothing of it really interests me. Okay. So that's it. It went into a mini game I looked into in my own time. Until next time, when we play more Final Fantasy XIV, I'm Mace and don't get lost.